area of focus in my community is to see that every woman has something doing. Don't stay indoors because what is killing us is when you are indoors, you don't know what is happening outside. You don't, you're not informed. But when you come out, you meet people, you, you are informed, you learn what others are doing, you start doing your own. If you are in this environment like seven years ago, you will see that everything is man. Women don't do anything. But now, women partake in almost everything, even in making laws. Even in the council, when they are sitting, they invite women to come and talk. Normally, women don't talk when men are sitting. I didn't know about the women land rights until I met Osfam, until Osfam took me to Ethiopia. I met people as ah, so women has the right to own land. And I brought that back and I'm happy that most women now are, be, are assessing land in their father's house. They take care of their school. So I want to encourage all of us that we should keep on doing our best. One day, the government will hear our voice and they will change this water issue for us and all of us will be happy. I keep on saying that I'm looking forward today that this abu that we are doing here, this fufu, they will say we should bring it abroad. We are seriously need, in need of water. And you see that or somebody comes around and says, oh, you people are in need of water. Let me put something that will bring water, put a borehole or something that will help you get water. You will see that they will be encouraged. They will know that, ah, so we are doing a good work that the government knows that we are doing something here. That is a part of encourage to do more. And the other was teaching them of best practice and how to do so that we can be able to export this cassava. This fufu we are doing has odor, but there is a way we can do it. It will be odorless. After analyzing it, we see that the cost of carrying out the odorless one is higher than what we can take. If you can, if the government can help us do a little thing, ah, okay, since people are doing fufu and you want to do the odorless one, you can export. What do you need? Okay, we need a dryer. If we get that, we can do odorless cassava that can be exported. What I'm looking forward is to see that these women here are able to export their cassava. That is my first target. If I'm able to see that in the next three, four years, these women are exporting their cassava. I will be the happiest person on earth. My name is Chijoke Ihoma Peace. I'm a woman advocate and I press for progress. <laughs>